This is a little sequence of um, basic ampuku, or Japanese abdominal massage, that I learned as a preparation to doing hara diagnosis for herbal treatment. And it's basically a soothing, warming, relaxing beginning to abdominal work. There's nothing deep in this, it's just a way of getting the abdomen soft, the person relaxed, ready to then either diagnose or do deeper treatment. So there are nine movements here. The first one, we come down from the sternum towards the navel area. And we come down the center line, down the ren channel, but we also come down the, just below the ribs in the subcostal area. In terms of the effect of this kind of treatment, it's both drawing chi down out of the chest where chi tends to get stuck and stagnant into the hara, but also dispersing the subcostal area, which is another typical area of chi stagnation. So you've got one two, three, and the movements are soft and fluid, some sort of medium paced. We then go into big circles around the, the navel. can also do this as the butterfly spreads its wings with the two hands or one hand over pretty much the same technique and then we do smaller circles that focus on the navel area itself from that into the wave technique, which we did in the general massage sequence. come above the navel and we let the hands move in opposite directions. It can create a little, just a nice little bit of a twist in the tissues and a good sort of warming, kind of releasing, relaxing feeling and we do the same below the navel. focus on really beginning to get down into the lower corners. So we're going to do one, two. One comes down the centre line, the other comes around the lower quadrant. One, two. This is a very effective way, in fact, of clearing around the sigmoid colon. to come right the way round the lower quadrant. So we go one, two. You can do this in different positions with your hands. If you're standing on the other side, you do it in a, in a slight, with your hands in a slightly different way. But as long as you get the direction of the movements, that's all that matters.
and then we're going to vibrate each of the corners This is a kind of fairly low frequency, high amplitude vibration, so it's a sort of shaking. And I said to you yesterday, shaking and vibrating is a really effective release technique for the Hara. And then finally, to finish off, a kind of scooping action that's going to gather everything in so we come down and round so it's like a diamond down the lower ribs and down below the navel That's the sequence. I'll just run over it again without too many breaks. <clears throat> and the, I'll, I'll do it how, how you might actually do it as the start of a horror massage treatment. So you get a sense of <clears throat> this can be very, very brief. So we might just go. And that's probably less than two or three minutes work and it's done a really nice little armor treatment. You could also take five or ten minutes and really spend a little time just doing this without doing any of the deeper release work and it would be very effective. Okay.